Star names littered the field as the 2021 World Triathlon Championship Series touched down in England. A new course in Leeds and 55 men taking the challenge, including iconic local heroes Alistair and Johnny Brownlee, Olympic silver medalist and five-time world champion Javier Gomez, and Aussie Jake Birtwistle, who won the last edition here two years ago. In the water, though, was a return to form for Aaron Royal, the Australian. Still doesn't know if he'll be at the Games in Tokyo, but he was out in a quick time, 17.39. Van Riel has ever a good swim. Alistair Brownlee was right there, but unfortunately for him, he'd later be disqualified for unnecessary roughness in the water. Richard Varga also disqualified for missing a boy in the swim, so plenty of drama. Although Brownlee was out front there, he would later learn the bad news. A large group of men rode round together. Johnny Brownlee there was right in that pack. He came in fresh off that victory the World Cup in Arzakena. Salvisberg and Schomburg tried a little attack on the fifth lap. They got away briefly, but soon came back to the field. And it was the youngster, 23-year-old Sam Dickinson, local to Leeds, who had his moment of TV glory. Some 10, 15 seconds clear of the field as they came towards T2. That lead, though, would be short-lived. It was his first ever championship series race. Christian Blumenfeld, who'd won in Yokohama a month back, he was right there, exactly where he wanted to be but there were plenty of excellent runners in the field. Not Javier Gomez, though. He was a DNF after an incident on the bike. Jonas Schomburg, we've seen him lead out previously. He tried the trick again, but it didn't work. And it wasn't long before the class of Alex Yi came to the fore. The 23-year-old Briton, not certain of his place in Tokyo. As it stands, only two British men will be going, and Johnny Brownlee will be one of them. But Yi basically decimated the field, taking over the lead after the end of lap one and sauntering across the line a really quick time. His first ever Championship Series victory, only his second ever podium. The former British 10,000 metre champion, Morgan Pearson, a terrific second place for the American. He's Tokyo bound, his second successive podium. And there was some time to wait before the third man appeared across the line. It was the Belgian, Martin Van Riel, who's starting to add some very consistent results to his resume. Excellent bronze for the Belgian. The American men's team looking pretty strong too. But the star of the show, unquestionably, Britain's Alex Yee. A first ever World Series goal. That was really special. Uh, it's the first time I've seen so many people uh, from Leeds and from the whole UK because of COVID and stuff. And, and it's just amazing to, to be able to deliver in front of them. And uh, I mean, this is a team effort, this result. So I'm just over the moon that I could just kind of deliver when it re really mattered. Confirmation then of the result. Yi Pearson and Van Riel, the podium. Fernando Alaza with uh, his best result for some while. Hayden Wild, a great result. He got special dispensation to come from New Zealand. Blumenfeld consistent as ever. And here's how the championship stands. Just 10 points at the top between Yi and Pearson. Blumenfeld currently in the bronze medal position. Alaza moves up to sixth. Yella Gaines stays where he is. He did not finish in Yorkshire. And Odakora sneaked into the top ten. All about Alex Yi, though, today. Surely he can't be left behind by the British Federation. He must go to Tokyo, mustn't he? A great performance.